The thyroid gland is an extremely important endocrine organ that secretes thyroid hormone, which has many vital functions in our body. Before we begin our discussion on hypothyroidism itself, let's quickly see some of the important functions of thyroid hormones. The main function of thyroid hormone is to maintain the basal metabolic rate, which is the rate at which the body uses energy at rest, to maintain vital functions such as breathing and keeping warm. In addition, it maintains the normal heart rate and rhythm and normal gastrointestinal motility. It also regulates normal growth and development, especially during childhood, and it promotes the brain development of the fetus. Moreover, thyroid hormones regulate brain function during adulthood. So, it seems like thyroid hormone has some extremely important functions in our body. Hypothyroidism is characterized by low thyroid hormone levels in blood. The two most important causes of hypothyroidism are iodine deficiency and Hashimoto's thyroiditis, which is an autoimmune disorder where the thyroid gland is destructed by the person's own antibodies. Hypothyroidism in infancy is specifically referred to as cretinism, and it is commonly associated with maternal hypothyroidism during fetal life. Signs and symptoms of cretinism include mental retardation due to impaired development of the central nervous system, short stature due to growth impairment, coarse facial features, protruding tongue, and umbilical hernia due to weakness of abdominal muscles. Most adult signs and symptoms are nonspecific for hypothyroidism. Some of them include the following. Fatigue, lethargy, and loss of energy. Weight gain, loss of appetite or anorexia. Cold intolerance. Dry skin and hair loss. Facial puffiness. Goiter, due to enlarged thyroid gland. Drowsiness, muscle and joint pain. Blurred vision. Depression and forgetfulness constipation, slow speech and movements, tongue enlargement, menstrual disturbances and impaired fertility, decreased hearing, and rough voice.